What is up guys? Welcome back to another Farming Simulator 17 Lone Oaks video and today guys we're doing something a lot different. We are actually planting. Uh, if you guys have not seen the squad's video that came out this morning, I was in it. So huge shout out to the squad and them for letting me be part of their video. And guys, I'm going to just explain real quick on this video. Do not ask me what the password is. The server is private. Unless given by one of the admins, the server is private. And guys, squad, if you do see the password on the squad's video, don't think that you can just go in there because you will be kicked and banned from the server. So with that being out of the way, we are back again. We've actually got a few different machines in now. This is my second trip over here. We are going to load up. And guys, as you all can see in the right hand corner we do have seasons mod in I'm running off of the Midwest seasons Ooh. oh yeah I was looking backwards from the inside so we're going to plant field 29 and wheat as well as field 30 we will round bell those get those ready for the cows we will be doing hay, so guys, I run a longer seasons compared to squad and everybody else. So I run a 9 day seasons, 9 to 12 day seasons, they run a 3 day seasons, so everything grows a lot quicker. So please just don't ask me anything about squad servers. And we've yet to... I don't know if we're going to place down the placeable fertilizer and sea tanks I don't know yet so we go ahead, we're going to start filling up with fertilizer here And how many, what is our fertilizer state at? So it's one state, we're going to go ahead, we're going to do three states fertilizer. Oh yeah, that's right, our seed point is on the inside. That's if this big machine will fit in there. Alright, so now we are loading up with bushels of seed to give plant field number 20. We will hire out a worker. We will go around the field one time, at least give uh, the 
hired worker some space to turn around. So let's roll on that. So guys, I am working on doing longer videos for y'all. And you guys will be seeing a lot of my classic tractors in this series. Like the 40, 40 series, 4240 will be in. The 6M will be in, the 6430 will be in. And like I said, we also got a bunch of new track, a couple new tractors in, a couple new seeding equipment, as well as a couple of new tillage equipment. We also got the coon pack in. So we are going to no-till this piece right here. We're just going to plant field 30 on and uh, And guys, I know y'all is probably going to say, well, more, why don't you just put the buy bales mod in? Guys, this is going to probably be the most realistic as it's going to be. And with FS19 getting closer, I'm going to probably wind up putting less and less videos out at a time. I know Squad said he's going to try to help out a little bit here and there when he's got time. And guys, we're always willing to make the channel bigger. I always appreciate the support that you guys give. And y'all always be one of my main reasons why I record every day. Or every other day, whenever I have time to record during the summer months. But I do apologize, I didn't put a video, video out yesterday. I'll be working on putting videos out more during the week. I was just been kind of a burned out recording myself. I so if you burn yourself out doing this, it's easier just to jump in and record with somebody else. And that's why guys I say squad is the person if you are on his good side and you're willing to have him let him or have him let you join the server that's one thing but please respect that we do run the servers and we are the channel owners for our channels So the sun's starting to come up. Where is it at? It's right there. Seven twenty-five in the morning, guys. We're out early this morning. I think we we started the video at like eight forty-nine yesterday, which was funny. y'all know how squad is squad is squad and squad's always fun to work with so we'll go ahead we are going to hire out a worker we're going to get and get some more equipment bought so I'll get this guy straight now he can work we're going to tab on over here. So we got the old classic Ford truck in today. We are going to be running the 7430 as well. We're going to put a loader on that. So we need another. 
Well, let's see what in the garage what all we do have. Cultivator, 180 horsepower required. So we got two sprayers, two wind rowers, brown baler, bale wagon, square baler. So guys, here's two of the new mods. We are, do need, we will need this. Hopefully we can do the modded bales with this. Oh, I forgot we got those. We got this here in too. So Hmm. Must be raining again. Yeah, we'll need this. So let's see, Z to open the net door, let's go ahead and refill, so now we can do 167 bales, but that's going to change because we are going to change the size to 1.3. We're going ahead and close that and we are going to be get ready to be off on our way. Oops. So guys, give me a few minutes. I got to do something. I'll be right back.
Alright guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. So, it is raining. I left the windows down on my truck. So, I had to go roll them up. I do want to get a loader ready as well. So let's go ahead. We are going to buy. So guys, we got all these loader options now. I hope this one works. And we will be putting in the manual attaching mod as well. Oh, that's the self-leveling loader. Nice. Yep, that fits on this tractor just fine. So guys, we're going to get rolling back to the farm. Throw our hazards on. So 141 round bills is what we can bail. With this amount of wrap in it. Which is good. Because this is the real most realistic way of doing it. Is have a baler that you can do the wrap on. So I might talk to squad. Have him watch this video so he can see this specific baler that now this baler is American crone is an American piece of equipment I've seen plenty of crone balers mowers out there so it is American and this was part of the DLC that did come out now I don't know if anybody can get this DLC But we're going to park this baler over here at the pig farm. Just to help kind of keep the amount of equipment apart. Oh yeah, there's a spot right there for it. Okay, so now with that being bought, let me jump over here to her trailers. Let me see if I did put it in. Yes, I did. The gooseneck header trailer. Now that is 39.7 feet compared to the end game which is 45 feet. Let 
we will need a combine so we'll go ahead we will buy this combine here and we'll number one extended pipe foldable grain tank So we'll pop back here at the shop. And there's that. We'll go ahead and back this on up. We'll leave the combine running. We'll fire up the Ford here. Pop in the combine. There we go, that is now on the trailer. So we're going to go ahead and run this chopper on down the road, or harvester down the road. Now this is a very wide unit guys. This would be recommended driving down the road other than hauling on to a trailer unless you have the magnitude. And this thing does take up the whole road. Makes me wonder if this is going to fit for this width of this thing up going up this back road. I'm not much of a fan of using beacons, guys. But if I have to, I'll have to. Forty-four forties. I'm as or the forty-six forties. I'm as done. Up oh, there he is. He's about halfway.
Now I do want to spray the hay fields. It's one thing I do want to do. But that will probably be the next video. Actually we'll do dry fertilizer instead of liquid. And I know we got these two fields as well as field 23 and field yeah field 24 and field 14 to do as well now the question is will this big machine as wide as it is fit in this shed we're about to find out Ooh, just barely. Now we'll jump over to the Ford. We got a pass lane, we're going to pass
I hope this big truck can fit. It does. So guys, this will be the end of the video. I want to thank y'all again so much for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed. Don't forget, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Oh, I didn't know about this. So guys, I'm going to do a quick, so guys, this is going to be the end of the video. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Thank you all so much again for the support. Always appreciated. And I'll see you all in the next Farming Simulator 17 video. You all have a good one.